Let's shift our attention for now. India's aim to reach the moon began with the very first Chandrayaan mission in 2008. Fast forward 15 years with phenomenal successes, a few setbacks. India's quest for the moon is still on. The Chandrayaan missions have inspired generations and they continue to do so till date. Let's take a look at India's lunar missions, what they found, what they missed and how did they build up on the work of their predecessors. Till date, India has three lunar missions, Chandrayaan, Chandrayaan-2 and Chandrayaan-3. While the first one was an orbiter mission, it also carried a moon impact probe along with it. Chandrayaan-1 was launched in the year 2008 by India's polar satellite launch vehicle, that's the PSLV-XL. It remained operational for over 10 months. Nearly 11 years later, Indian Space Research Organization, ISRO, launched Chandrayaan-2 mission. It carried an orbiter, lander and a lunar rover on board. The mission was launched by ISRO's GSLV MK3 rocket on the 22nd of July 2019. Four years later, on the 14th of July 2023, ISRO launched Chandrayaan-3. Launched by ISRO's LVM-3, Chandrayaan-3 carries the Vikram lander and the Pragyan rover of Chandrayaan-2. It also carried an orbiter, a lander and the Pragyan rover, as I mentioned. With the first Chandrayaan, ISRO wanted to map the lunar surface to study its mineral and chemical composition, among other things. With Chandrayaan-2, ISRO wanted to reach the far side of the moon, that to its south pole, where Chandrayaan had detected the presence of water. It also wanted to build on the findings of Chandrayaan-1 by studying the mineral abundance on the lunar surface and subsurface. Chandrayaan-3, it seeks to accomplish what its predecessor could not. With the latest lunar mission, ISRO is once again trying to land near the lunar south pole. The mission will also help in studying lunar quakes, thermal properties of the lunar surface and so on. It also plans to conduct on-site experiments on the lunar surface. Talking about the key findings and the outcomes now, the Chandrayaan mission became popular for detecting the presence of water on the moon. It was successful in completing its other objectives as well. The second lunar mission, Chandrayaan-2, found crucial data by studying some of the permanently shadowed regions of the moon, including many craters. However, the Chandrayaan-2 mission could not achieve success in landing on the lunar surface. Contact with the Vikram rover was lost while it was descending on the surface, making the mission a partial success. And now, the Chandrayaan-3 mission is less than 36 hours away from attempting a lunar landing. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.